Uh, it has a big effect on jockeys' livelihoods. Um, it's going to be a difficult one to, to recover from. But look, it's the same for every walk of life. Uh, we're all in it together now, and um, we just need to uh, ride out the storm and get back going, get back working, so and get the, the show back on the road. Uh, self isolation is uh, hard. Uh, we're usually we're used to going from uh, not to sixty um, every day, and uh, the whole pace of the thing has slowed down dramatically. So. Um, just looking forward to getting back up to that pace again. Uh, racing will be able to recover. It has to recover. Um, it's a huge part of um, Irish heritage and history, and um, you know we're very good at it here in Ireland. So um, it has a great chance of recovering. Um, just it'll probably take that little bit of time, and it'll need plenty of support. But you know it is an outlet for people to get out and enjoy themselves. So. Hopefully people will, will, will see that and uh, continue their support for uh, racing. Uh, Tiger Rolls in good form. He, came, he was a little bit sore coming out of Cheltenham. Uh, he had a tough race and what looked like very testing ground. Uh, he is a little bit better on better ground. Uh, Keith just felt that the ground um, just caught him a little bit uh, to get the very best out of him. And the winner is very, very good good horse a real cross-country specialist but uh he was a little bit sore afterwards but uh he seems to have after recovering well he is uh he has an uncanny way of recovering there himself he um he sometimes goes into a little bit of a lull and uh all of a sudden he starts to to blossom so hopefully now he can um he'll have a break i don't think he'll run during after after um this unless the irish national or something like that but uh hopefully he'll be back next year and uh he can have a crack at uh third grand national